Hey, this is Brett, and this 2022 Ram 5500 regular cab, chassis cab, 84 inch cab to axle, uh, tradesman edition is stock number 22T29. We are here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used heavy duty truck headquarters. This 2022 Ram 5500 has the 6.7 liter Cummins diesel engine and that's gonna put out 360 horsepower, 800 foot-pounds of torque, and it's max trailering, because this one has the max tow package, is uh, 35,220 pounds of max trailering per uh, Ram's website that I got that information off of. Um, this one obviously has a flatbed upfit on it. Now that's 11 foot um, flatbed, by seven feet, 11 inch, seven feet, 11 and a half inches wide. Um, so we're gonna check that out, obviously. This one comes with the 19 and, a, 19 and a half inch heavy duty steel wheels and it has Hankook Smart Flex DH35 tires. These are 225, 70 R19 and a halfs. And uh, you can see those are definitely heavy duty rims and the heavy duty tires. Spring and shock in the front. Get the uh, fender flares on there as well. The cab lights up top. And I just wanted to take a look at this Napide flatbed that has been put on here. You get a bunch of boxes, storage boxes, and they've got nice chains that hold those doors from falling. And then we have the steel outsides. It's got holes for if you wanted to put um, two by fours in there. And then the bed is actually wood. It's painted wood. And of course there's some tie downs here and stuff and those can spin. So from the front there to the back is 11 feet, almost exactly. And then from one side to the other is seven foot, 11 and a half inches. You can see it does have tow package. You get these uh, tow hooks, seven pin wiring. You get the lights back here as well. You also get a nice step. And this is actually like, I don't know, metal. These pieces are metal. So it's pretty cool, heavy duty for sure. And then the boxes on the uh, other side are exactly the same as these boxes on this side. You can check out that heavy duty suspension. Um, get the anti-sway bar back there as well. And I count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine leaf springs on this thing. So definitely heavy duty. Then you get the uh, back rack there. Take a look at the original window sticker. Now keep in mind that this MSRP on here is not the price of the truck because of the upfit. It is uh, much higher than that. Um, and I'll give you that price in a second. We'll also give you a link to our website. But you can just see all the options that this particular truck has. The 6.7 liter Cummins diesel, six speed automatic ice and transmission. Um, everything on your left there is your standard equipment, including a 52 gallon fuel tank. Um, you connect three with the five inch touch screen and everything else there. And then the optional equipment is the cold weather group, which is 175 bucks. Electrical accessory group, which is 545 trailer light check, um, which that's pretty nice. Heavy duty snowplow prep group, max tow package is 695. The chrome appearance group, tradesman level one, gives you the tow mirrors, remote keyless entry, speed sensitive power locks and power windows with one touch down feature. And then you get the, the ice and transmission is a thousand bucks. And then the Cummins diesel is 8,745. Has a power takeoff prep on it. Chrome step bars are 495. The uh, all traction tires are 250. And the backup camera is 495, which it still does work even um, with the uh, flatbed on it. And it does have a manual DPF regeneration, which is 245. So, like I said, the price that I'm about to show you is not the price of this truck. It's actually 
The price on this truck right now on our website is $78,400. So you can do the math from $63,685. That's how much the uh, upfit for that flatbed is. Um, so the MSR, the retail price on this one is $78,400. And there's actually a link to our website in the upper right hand part of the screen. Um, you can click that and it'll take you right to the VDP on our website. Uh, so check that out. Three year 36 bumper to bumper and five year 100,000 mile warranty. And it's not rated for uh, fuel economy or government crash test ratings. So you get the heavy duty uh, work grade vinyl, the black and the gray there. Looks pretty good inside. You get the heavy duty rubber floors and uh, we'll go check out on the driver's side. Just give me one second, we'll hop over there. All right, so first thing I wanna show you is, are these uh, stickers because everybody always wants to know this information and they always ask me to do it in these new truck videos, so I definitely will do that. Um, gross vehicle weight rating is 19,500 pounds and uh, the GAWR rear is 13,500. Um, PW7's paint coat, which is bright white. There's your VIN sticker. And then this is your NAPHIDE truck equipment that has to go on there after they do that flatbed. So that is the actual um, stuff on there. Anyways, power locks, power windows, power mirrors, auto headlamps. We'll hop inside. And we'll just check out the radio and everything too. As long as we're in here, this one has 40 miles on it. So you get a digital speedometer, compass display. Um, obviously, instru instrument cluster is nice and clean. You get multifunction steering wheel, cruise controls, gear selector, uh, Bluetooth and information center controls, the six speed heavy duty ISIN transmission. And then you get um, five inch touchscreen radio, AM, FM radio. And uh, at the end here, we'll start it up. I'll finish the interior here. Climate controls, factory brake controller. It has five auxiliary upfit switches and then a PTO uh, button. If you do a power takeoff, has two USBs, two USB C's and an AUX jack. And then your four by four shifter is right here. It does come with the keyless entry fob like that. And um, that's cool. Stability control. And you do get map lights up there. Uh, not too much else to show you. Has the 40 20 40 split bench seating. You do get three cup holders in the center here. And uh, that's where your backup camera shows up. And I guess we'll start it up and then I'll show you the backup camera and then we'll do a final walk around. It does have the backup beeper and there is a little bit of water on that lens right now, but um, it does work nicely. And that beeper works nicely as well. You get a little bit of storage behind those back seats. And I think that's a winter front over there. And then a receiver hitch reducer and everything. So really nice truck. She's ready to do a lot of work. We'll do our final walk around here. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, this 4K video, you have been able to get a really good idea of the overall options, information, looks, and uh, check out that flatbed on this truck. Thanks for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on our YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash if you want to check out more videos and more vehicles, you can go to our website right there, summitauto.com, full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. Uh, in fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Ram heavy duty truck videos like this one in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. And we're super excited to be offering this brand new 2022 Ram 5500 Tradesman Level 1 with the max tow package and bright white clear coat with a nap hide flatbed upfit to it. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share.